Mrs. Baker and Anafi here, and I hope you're having a wonderful Sunday morning. Now, we are going to do our kiss jam. So, we're going to do two songs today. We're going to do our brand new one that we just did last week. And one of the newer ones that we like, uh, the slower, like, ooh, 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 we're going to do that one. Alright, so, let's do our worship. So let us stand up, make sure you have some room. I do not want to hear you hit your brother during worship. And we're going to dive into worship. You ready? All right, three, two, one.
Jam. Sorry, that song is such a good song. I want to sing along with you guys because it's true. Our God is so big and so strong and he is so mighty. Now, let's talk about what we're going to talk about today. We are going to be talking about the Great Commission. Now, that is a big word. It's just a fancy word for, you know, God had a plan, and he was telling his disciples the plan that he had for them. And he called it the Great Commission. I think some of you guys may have heard of it, but if not, we're going to go over it. It can be found in Matthew 26, 16 to 20. If you want to open your Bibles, and we'll dive right in. Verse 16. Then the eleven disciples went to Galilee, to the mountain where Jesus told them to. When they saw him, they worshipped him. You know, they were singing like, My God is so big and so strong and mighty," and other songs. But some of them doubted. What? Verse 18 says, Then Jesus came to them and said, All authority in heaven and on earth has been given to me. Therefore, go, make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and, all, and of the Holy Spirit and teach them 
to obey everything I've commanded you. And surely I am with you always to the very end of ages. Okay, that, that, that is a lot. That is a lot. So let's, let's unpack this. So 11 of the disciples went up to the mountain where they saw Jesus. And when they saw Jesus, they were singing and they worship him and they were like, my God is so big and so strong and so mighty. You know, he conquered the grave, he conquered the crown, all this stuff. And Jesus was telling them, you know, go, make disciples of all nations. Because back in those days, they only hung out with Jewish people. And he didn't want just Jewish people. He wanted, you know, Gentiles and other people and so many. He wanted all the nations to hear his name and to be baptized and be taught by him. So that's what we do. We, you know, that's what Miss Faith does. She teaches you guys how to follow God. And that's what I'm doing today. We're talking about God. And you can be a dis you can do the Great Commission as well. If you go and you tell people about Jesus and you have them go to church and they get baptized and they start listening to his word. Okay, that was a lot. But I think you guys got it. So let's pray. Let's bow our heads, close our eyes. Dear Lord, I pray that you would help us with the Great Commission. I pray that you would just guide us with your love and help us to make disciples. Help us to go and make disciples. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, Kitch Jam, bye. I'm going to go worship. My God is so big and so strong and so mighty.